Hi there. Tonight there's no less than three uh, discs uh, which I'm going to very briefly show you and I nearly call them 78s, um, which they really aren't. And that's why I'm showing them to you because they are strange things. You, I'm sure you've seen lots of strange records yourselves, but we're just going to deal with three of these really quite quickly so the sooner I stop talking and get into the first one uh, the better it will be. So here is this um, Edison Bell little champion record dates from about 1909 or something like that and um, it's, a it's a slightly unusual size for this uh, period it's about nine inches in diameter which is about 20 it's slightly under it's about 22.5 centimeters uh, but the interesting thing about it is it's phono cut uh, so in other words the, 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 the groove goes or the groove the, the recording goes up and down instead of from side to side so we can't just play this uh, in the normal way we have to tinker with it a bit okay so we'll now play our little champion record uh, which is a tune uh, or a waltz called Your Eyes Have Told Me So written by Carr Hardy played by the Royal Court Orchestra uh, which I assume is the theatre uh, orchestra of the Royal Court Theatre in Sloane Square in London that uh, Edison Bell used them a lot to make their records and we'll put it on, here we go and you'll notice that the sound is very thready and that's because <coughs> we can't directly play these records, these vertical cut records with our stereo cartridge um, but we can record them onto the hard drive and then tweak the sound about a bit and that's what we've done actually Okay, the next record is also phono cut, vertically cut, um, and it's a Pathé. This one is a 30 centimetre, 12 inch, 30 centimetre record, and um, it tells us on the packet that it should be played at 90 RPM, so it's obviously not a 78. Um, some other packets uh, simply specify between 90 and 100, um, but this one, assuming this record belongs in this packet, this one actually is 90, which is, uh, you know, quite exceptional. So here we go with our Pathé. We've set the speed to uh, 90 RPM. Off we go. And... Uh oh, wait a minute. Hang on. Aha, well I'm, play I'm playing a joke on you. I'm sure you know already that one of the strange things about these is that they begin here. And the third of our unusual records is this uh, world record dating from about 1922 or 23, um, which is a 10-inch, 25-centimetre record, uh, but it is also not a 78, as we will discover when we try to play it. OK, so here we go to play our world record. Um, we start the turntable. And... Um, here we go. And of course we're reset to 78 now. Oh dear. Well something's terribly wrong. 
it's playing far too fast. Also, it sounds as though Well, well. Yes, I'm afraid it's a constant velocity groove record, uh, so we'll have to go into that as well.